This video is intended to demonstrate the difference between PIP on the conventional and PIP on the high frequency jet ventilator. Here you can see I have a conventional ventilator set at a rate of 20, but most importantly a peak inspiratory pressure of 20, a PEEP of 5. The jet ventilator is set at a PIP of 30, and there it is trying to reach 30 on the monitored display. So the important part of this demonstration is that the jet is delivering a peak inspiratory pressure of 30 while the conventional is delivering only 20. When I show just the conventional breaths by themselves, you can see very aggressive bubbling out of the leak that I created by removing one of the balloons from my Tesla. Most of the air is exhausted through the leak and very little, if any, is getting to the alveoli. So the peripheral alveoli are being robbed of tidal volume because most of it is being exhausted out the leak. Just imagine if that was a pneumothorax or PIE. With just the life pulse running, you can see that there's no bubbling out the air leak. The peripheral alveoli are being ventilated, as indicated by the wiggle. Even the ones adjacent to the leak are receiving some degree of ventilation by the jet ventilator, and there's no active bubbling through the air leak that I've created in my test lung. When I run the two together, remember the conventional ventilator PIP is at 20, the life pulse ventilator PIP is at 30. Both ventilators are running at the same time, and you can see whenever a conventional breath comes, again, very aggressive bubbling out that leak. Most of the gas is being exhausted. The life pulse is much more gentle, much more effective at ventilating. It's ventilating the peripheral alveoli without aggravating the air leak. Uh, so this is very important. When, even with 10 centimeters of water more pressure, the jet ventilator is more gentle. So you will have to give a few side breaths if you're doing a temporary recruitment maneuver to reverse atelectasis, but you can see why it's so important to get rid of those conventional breaths once the lungs have been recruited and PEEP has stabilized inflated alveoli. The moral of the story really is that raising the jet PIP or the high frequency jet ventilator life pulse PIP is much safer and more effective than raising the conventional mechanical ventilator PIP.